Some careers burn bright like a shooting star. And some get better with age like a fine Kentucky bourbon. And then there are those that barely move the needle. Kevin and I both came up in the Bush series. And what he lacked in talent, he certainly made it for him. Can I see a picture? I might actually be thinking of the wrong guy. Oh, yeah, my bad. Uh, he's definitely not the right guy. Who is this guy? Oh, he's the best. He's not joining our team, is he? No. He's the best. Then, on September 4th at Darlington, history was made. Darlington, boy. Everybody wants to hear that story. We can talk about something else. Your dad was a bouncer? No, my mom was. Uh, so Darlington, yeah. Boy, I can't even remember. Did I win that race? Let's check the trophy. Mm, I did. What do I think of Kevin Gibson? That guy's an He calls me Kevin Harry And if I spot him in the parking lot, I'm gonna straight up his that He was the most competitive SOB I ever met in my whole life. He'd race you on the track and off the track. One time he pushed me out of the way to get to a urinal. I'm like, dude, there are five of them open. And he's like, I like the end slot. Just three weeks after his victory, his career hit a wall at 200 miles per hour. My dad said Kevin was screaming, I can't move my legs, I can't move my legs, I'll never dance at my wedding. Kevin didn't realize he was strapped to the gurney. He was fine. He did hurt his back pretty bad. Never got married. Kevin wasn't able to drive again after that, but thanks to team owner Bobby Spencer, he found a new career as a crew chief. Kevin is like a father to me, I guess. I mean, I never really knew my father. He ran out one Halloween, said he was gonna get more Butterfingers, and then he just, you know, never came back. Kevin is more than my boss. We have so much fun together. Oh, we, we love to do this thing where we scare each other. One time I got to work early and I hid in his office. And uh, when he came in, <laughs> I jumped out at him and he like, wow, he like freaked and he just, he threw hot coffee right in my face. <laughs> and I was like screaming and just crying. And, and he was like screaming and crying. <laughs> and it was, <laughs> Kevin and I are more than just coworkers. We're friends. You know, when I started, I was worried that I wasn't gonna fit in. But Kevin was just so welcoming. I still remember on my first day, he knocked over a quart of oil, and he looked me straight in the eyes and he said, my bad, you mind cleaning that up, pal? Pal. Man, I would lay down my life for Kevin. Well, not as the first option. I mean, I respect the heck out of Bobby Spencer, but I mean, I used to, before they hired Kevin Gibson. I mean, why not just hire a monkey? I mean, you still wouldn't win, but at least you'd have a monkey. 